As the Biden administration flies migrants from the border and relocates them across the United States, Pennsylvania Republicans are asking, why not redirect those flights to the president's home state of Delaware? Pennsylvania State Senator Mario Scabello plans to draft a bill to do just that, and he joins us now. Senator, thanks so much for being here. Talk to us about your bill that you're proposing, and, and what do you know about how many undocumented uh, immigrants, illegals, have, have landed in Pennsylvania? Well, first, thank you for uh, giving me the opportunity to come on. Uh, it's numerous. They've been flying them into Allentown. They've been flying them into Philly. They've been flying them into Wilkes-Barre. Uh, so, um, you know, it, it's, it's, it's quite, a, it, it's, it's quite a, a, a group. And from what I'm understanding, uh, in my particular area, there's about two, three hundred. And my biggest point in this whole thing is that um, you have approximately, um, you know, the, every school district has a, has a cost per educating a child. And it's in my district, it's about 20,000. And if you put two, three hundred students in these schools, um, and they're, they're, now there's many of them don't speak English. The cost goes to about thirty, thirty-five thousand, and it's borne by the residents that live in those school districts, and it's significant. So throughout the the state, throughout the country, uh, this is happening, and it's and it's borne by the local people in those communities. And frankly, I have seen the citizens in tears on the phone with letters to me, on the phone with me, complaining about their school taxes that continue to increase on a regular basis. So I'm looking to, just to stop this. Now, I did, I did receive a phone call from somebody in, in um, Delaware, in the home state of Delaware. I said, look, they belong at the border, but you're, the, the president isn't enforcing it. So hopefully he'll, he'll support, the, uh, support you in your state. I said, you, we just can't continue to live like this. And I've had calls right. from other states. Tennessee also, matter of fact, the uh, rep in Tennessee wants to introduce the same legislation as well. Senator, uh, beyond the legislation, which, by the way, I think is a fascinating piece of legislation, and it, puts, it would put your critics in a very interesting bind. Explain to me why this is a problem. If it's not a problem, then you should be ready to accept them in Delaware. But, but beyond <coughs> that, beyond the, the symbolism, but if, beyond the symbolism, does the bill actually do anything? Can it accomplish this? Can you redirect planes that would be otherwise headed to Pennsylvania? Well, uh, first of all, th with, with this, we're going to uh, also vote on the, on the Senate floor to tell Congress, enforce our immigration laws. You know, we're a nation of laws. Enforce our laws. And that's going to be the, the, the number one issue for us. But at the same token, I'm assuming my governor probably would veto this bill. And if he does, he's on record of allowing <laughs> But I can can we yes there he's the the governor of Florida is doing it uh, he, he he you know he I that's why I got the idea of be very honest with you and I think every state should look at that very closely if he's not going to protect our border right. well then let the states protect their states. Hmm.